Welcome back to another episode of the wonderful weaving world of phenobarbital. Today we're going to be discussing something that I love. Ponytails. They're tight. They're high. They're tails. They come from ponies. Let's start with our metal comb brush, your teasing comb, hair ties, hairspray, freezing hairspray, strong hold, and lastly, a hair dryer. And of course, my wig stand. These days, everybody's got a ponytail. Ariana Grande, Beyonce, J-Lo, all the lows. To start, I have blocked my wig on my head. It is very sturdy. I've also secured the wig at the back of the head to make sure that when I pull the ponytail up high on the head, it does not gather the back and it stays put. I've also brushed my hair so it's nice and soft. I'm going to use the hard bristles on my teasing comb to help me gather and smooth the hair. I'm going to go in with my metal paddle brush and continue to brush the hair. I want to make sure that there's no knots in it, so it should just be able to brush right through. Taking my hand, placing it under, and brushing the hair back into my hand. You can see how this is taking the hair and gathering it into my hand and slowly bringing it up onto the crown. So you'll notice while we're doing this, we've got a lot of bumps and gathers and so on and so forth. That's where this wide tooth metal comb is gonna come in really handy at first. You wanna make sure we dig in and pull all the way out. You don't wanna just pull to here and then have a whole bunch of, cause then you're gonna wrap the hair right at the, the base of the ponytail. You don't wanna do that. You wanna make sure it's nice and smooth. That's why we have multiple brushes too. Don't be discouraged if you get this far and you realize, oh, I've gathered too much on one side or the other. You can always let the hair down and start over again. This is where we take out our hairspray. This is gonna help keep the hair where it is while you still play with it. Give it a good shake. Get a nice, clean spray. We're gonna take our teasing comb. And if you look up close, well, we can't see it from the camera, we have little droplets of hairspray. You don't want those to solidify as droplets. So, you brush through, spreading the wonderful hairspray glue evenly through the hair. I've chosen blonde elastics today because we're using a blonde wig. Now I'm holding onto this very tight, very taut, and I'm going to, with this hand, with the elastic just like this in my thumb and my two fingers, take, swoop, hold, pull, and we're going to wrap the elastic Different elastics are whew, able to go around a different amount of times. This one we're gonna do, oh, three. Ooh. Like I said, don't be afraid if this comes out, because you can always do it again. I 100% believe the saying that beauty is pain. Just by looking at me, you can tell I'm in pain. From the side, it's a little bit further back than I'd like it. Because from the front, it just looks like a slick back hairstyle. I want that ponytail to sit up here, but I want to be able to do it without taking it out. I'm going to take my hair, divide it down the center, pull it taut, and then brush out. We can take the front of the hair, like so. And this hair is coming from the front of the wig. Now, you can pull that forward while holding the back part, and then gently pull forward. Pulling taut. It's now sitting at a place on the head where I feel comfortable. Bobby pins. I'm gonna use the bobby pin to secure the hair tie into the wig, slipping it in, 
and one on either side. Now our ponytail is secured. Next, we're gonna take care of those little bumps. I'm going to take hairspray, my teasing brush, and a blow dryer, and we're gonna smooth out those bumps. Saturate. right in the front where the bumps are, load it up, on a low setting we're going to place our comb into the wig, pull towards the ponytail, and hold the blow dryer. What this does is it helps to freeze the hair using the hairspray in a snatched back position. Working all the way around. This is also a helpful trick if you have a serious center part in the wig when you do a ponytail and it's hard to get rid of that. Take a little bit of hairspray, or a lot of it, freezing hairspray, spray it right on that center, using your thick bristled brush. Brush into and pull back and drop. Want to make sure that all the hair is nice and secured and dried before continuing on to our next step. I think I've had enough. Snatched like a helmet. Look at that. We have our ponytail nice and even, right where we want it. We're gonna disguise all of these side pieces. Taking our teasing brush, we're gonna section off the back part of the ponytail, just like that. So now we have this piece to brush through with your metal brush. Come down, come down. Get all those knots out. Taking the front part of the ponytail, holding it up, you're going to have in your other hand the back portion that we sectioned, and you're going to wrap. Wrap this piece right around the base of the ponytail. Now you can see we've disguised our hair tie and the bumps. We're going to take some bobby pins. We're going to play bobby pin. Don't be afraid to go back in with your blow dryer and your hairspray. Your trusty hairspray. She's looking good. Now if you're using it for a show, you can add a little bit of body to it, a little bit of back combing, make it fluffier. Here we have. Thank you for joining me on another incredible episode of the wonderful weaving world of Fina Barbatal. Wow, the ponytail. What an incredible hairstyle. Do you think you can do it? I think you can. I wanna see it though. Tag me in your photos, tag me in your videos. Let me know what you think. Any questions, put them down below. I'm going to be reading. And while you're down there, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.